Ladies and gentlemen, we're back with K1 World Grand Prix 2021 Japan. Keys Fiesta 4, this is day one. I'm Russell Goodall. And I'm Nicholas Pettis. Nicholas, we've got the K1 uh, welterweight uh, fight here. That means 70, uh, sorry, 67.5 kg between Japan's Kaisei Kondo and from Thailand, Maki Doan Sompon. Mm. Interesting fight. This is uh, Kondo's first fight after he injured himself in the crush uh, competition that had last year, that's 2020, back in August. Mm -hmm. And finding him, Maki Duan Sompo from Thailand, is this is his first K1 fight. Interesting. It's always interesting to see fighters coming back after injury. Right. So Kondo broke his hand, right? He broke his wrist, wrist uh, oh. right wrist, yeah. Interesting. So six months in, physically the bones should be fine. Right. If he was smart doing his rehab, it would have been okay to come in and fight exactly like he did before. Mm -hmm. The only really question is how much sparring did he miss out on in this, during these six months? Right, obviously because you can't do your, your usual 100% training. No, not for the first two, three months at least. Mm -hmm. And then it's overcoming the mental aspect of it. Right. Looks like both fighters are kind of uh, measuring each other out with a nice few kicks there. Yeah, well, this is classic Muay Thai style, which mm. is actually a, probably a good pace for his comeback fight for Kondo to get into. Right. Uh, the only thing we should consider is the experience of the Thai fighter is going to be way above him. Yes. I mean, he's still, what, 19? <laughs> yeah. This is uh, Kondo's, uh, this is, uh, if you like, the new hope, the new hero of the new age of K1 here. Mm. Uh, a lot, lot, to, lot to go for his uh, rest of his career. Maki, on the other hand, has had 78 wins. So he's, he's been around. He's, he's had oh, a few yeah. fights. Oh, but Thai fighters, they fight every weekend, so <laughs> <laughs> it's a little bit different. <laughs> well, no denying there. This is round one. We've got uh, two, two minutes left. Still not a lot of uh, happening, but um, would Kondo be afraid because this is his first fight after he's broken his wrist? I don't think so. He looks really calm and, and like collected in there. Mm. Um, and if he is as good as they say he is, then he'll be just fine. I see, that was a beautiful little block there. Nice. So not a lot going on in the first round, but Muay Thai fighters never open up hard. They build it up. It's all about the third round, right, if right. it's a five round fight. But um, it seems like they, they have a, a hard time adapting to the three round uh, system of the K1 fights. Because Muay Thai is five and K1 is three, huh? Yeah. Right. But then again, with the experience, some of the Thai fighters are absolutely brilliant. So mm. it doesn't matter. It's and just... Yeah, <laughs> he wants the fight to happen. It's like, come on, come <laughs> on, come and get it, yeah. Because, I mean, you're probably half joking and half serious about when they fight every, every weekend, but there are more, lots of fights, right, with Muay Thai. Obviously. Oh, they do. Yeah. Uh, uh, unless they're, like, injured and they can't, then they, they literally fight every weekend. Wow, yeah. So that's got to bring experience. So actually, at 25, yeah. Maki is, uh, is considered probably, like, someone that would already be retired in Thailand. Really? They don't last very long, <laughs> and wow. they start very young. Right, right. But because of that, the sheer amount yeah. Yeah, of, of fights. Here he goes uh, again, Maki Duan Sompo. But the top Lumpini champions, for example, they're only they're in their teens. Right, right, right. Yeah. It's like, uh, yeah, like race horsing almost. Mm. So I like his attitude yeah. though, Maki. Yeah. <laughs> he seems yeah. to be having fun. Yeah, enjoying the fight. We've got 10 seconds left. Uh, not, not a lot happened in mean, the first half of this round one. Warning, warning there from something from Maki Duan Sompo. Oh, he connected with something nice. So do you think uh, we we'll, might see something on the replay? But was it some of the? It must have been a punch. Yeah. Mm. It must have been a punch. Interesting. See, he sits down. He's not even tired. He doesn't need to sit down. But it's just the way they're 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 taught to do it here. Right. 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 You think um, it, it helps or doesn't help? If you know, depending on like these, when you sit down. At this point, in these two guys' sight, it doesn't matter whatsoever. Right. right. Yeah. yeah. I mean, they're not even breathing hard. Yeah. So, what I'm looking forward to is going to be the second round. Oh, see, that's the jab that got him. Nice. You think He's got a really clean jab. What, which which hand is he punching with that condo? Is he using this right? I'm not quite sure which one he broke, but I mean, he has been doing something. Not a lot, not a lot. He's been really just sussing it out and feeling it out yeah. because he knows that the second round, the pace is going to go up. Mm, right, right. So, Maki Duan Sompo is still some, some really risky, but uh, 
Here we go, round two. Between Kondo and Dylan Sampo. It'd be nice to see some good combinations from Kondo. The Thai fighters, although they're not very big, they can be super awkward to fight. That was nice. Yeah. I told you the pace is going to go up in the second round. Nice counter attack. Wee. He's got a really clean jab. That one. Connects almost every time. Keep the distance. Nice. I gotta tell you, this is my first time to see Kondo fight. Yep. But so far, I'm really impressed. So he broke his uh, right hand, but it looks like he's punching with his left today. Yeah. Yeah. Well, wow, jabbing. Oh, that's yeah. good. That's good. Nice. Oh, look at that jab. So beautiful. Finally, someone doing it right. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ooh, give me a two pound on his body there. Wow. Oh, man. I can't believe he's only 19. Going on 17 by the looks of that, yeah. So he's the youngest of three brothers? Yes. And they run a gym together yeah, somewhere? I think, I think it's got, their father runs a gym. Oh, wow. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, so he's purebred. Yeah, That's they, cool. They That's why he's so... Yeah. 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 Like, like the green seeds, I guess. Yeah. yeah. Well, a lot of damage there. But uh, still um, doing something. You know, doing his kicks. Yeah. Oh, giving... And a nice punch, too. Great defense. And just his attacks are so clean. His balance and strength is awesome, man. This is really cool to watch, actually. Nice. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Woo. Oh. Tricky. Tricky. He literally is taking down Maki with his jab. The control with that jab is nuts. Bam, again. Boom. Big bomb there. But Mikey's not um, backing through, you know. He's, no, he's, not, he's doing he's good. He's not backing up, you know. But this is again Muay Thai style, right? right. Like the more middle kicks you kick, you're gonna get more points, and it builds ah. up. Ah, right, right. But he knows that this is the only thing he can do because he's getting hammered with the jab. Mm -hmm. Woo! Oh, what? He's walking away from that. He... Yeah, he's that. Didn't know there was a 10-second yeah. count there. Ooh, that was dangerous. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, and it was the first round. He definitely didn't know yes, that. Yes, because again, this is the first uh, K1 fight and with the heat on and everything. Yeah. It's because uh, it's not a, like a gong, like a sound. Exactly. So it, it can be distracting or... Yeah. Deceptive, I would say. Deceptive, yeah. Yeah. I think he learned that lesson well. No, because he clearly just stopped fighting. Yeah, you know? yeah. <laughs> and then Kondo went for him. Oh. Well, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he saw a chance. He saw an opening. So, as a as a fighter, he had to, I guess. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. He clearly took this round, uh, like, on points. Mm. I'd say the first round could be even. The second round definitely um, Kondo won. Not because of this, but because sure. of this. Just dominant. Yeah. Precise too, by the way. Kondo, you know. I don't know how much he's reserving because of his, uh, what he came through after the injury, but you know, we'll see more in the third round between Kaisei Kondo and Maki Duan Sompon. So round three, this is it. It's all going to be decided in this round. Certainly looks that way. Not, not happening yet, but... Interesting with a kick by. I'll tell you why. Under why? Uh, because he got him really good in the second round. Yeah. Uh, Maki is probably in his Muay Thai mind thinking, okay, if I don't knock him out, yeah. then I'm not going to win the fight. So I'm going to try and finish strong. It means he's not in a hurry to get in. I see. That's what it seems like. Mm. But the thing is, Maki is controlling him so well. Mm. You can 
scene lining up for the big middle kick. Yeah, that, that, and Maki, the ones who were following uh, Kondo too, you know. Yeah. As you say, trying to control what uh, Kondo does, but we'll see what Kondo does. Oh, oh, look at there that. We go. That was a nice bomb. <laughs> Maki punches back too. That's some good middle kicks there for Monkey. Come on, jab him again. Okay, I'd say Kondo slowed down a little bit too much in this fight now. There you go, you gotta come back. Mm. There you go. Here we go. Yeah. Maybe he was just pacing himself to try and finish strong in the last minute. Yes. It's hard to say what they're thinking because he could also be that he's hurting somewhere ah, that no. we don't really know about. Right, right. Because those kicks on the arm, they're pretty powerful. And he's gotten a lot of them. He has got a lot of them, hasn't he? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, shit. He looks to be a bit tired, to be honest. Kondo does, right? Yeah. And Maki, I mean, Maki, obviously, he used to five rounds. So he's, he's not, you know, either that or just... I don't know, he just didn't have the sharpness that he had in the second round. Sure. Okay. He's got 30 seconds left. Someone's going to have to finish strong to win this. Otherwise, it might go for an extension. Well, that's the idea, right? Like, you finish, but still have enough strength or vigor or lift. Yeah. So the judges can see that. Ooh, okay. Good, good. Yeah. I'm feeling a little. See what Maki Duanzo can do there. <laughs> Not much. Interesting, really interesting. It's like a chess player. He doesn't lose his calm. I mean, Kondo, just, right? Yeah. 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 But you can see he's really tired. <laughs> Could be. You never know. Uh, yeah. Coming back from an injury. You know, if you spent the, the first three months not sparring at all, mm -hmm. not even hitting or you know, doing the normal training, right. then well, he's only really been training for two, maybe oh, three months, oh, yeah. and not sparring the whole time. Maybe this is just a little bit of a, you know, a rude awakening call. See, I told you it could be a draw. 29, 29 the first one is a draw. Second to Kondo. Yeah. He wins by decision. Okay, so legend, we have a winner. That's Kaiso Kondo uh, by decision. And this K1 Walter uh, Wakes. Here we have it, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, Kondo there going on. To his opponent and to the team. Just for reference, if I had to judge this fight, it would have been 30 29. Two. Kondo. Kondo. Hmm. Yeah, I only think he won the, the second round. Right, right. It would have been maybe 29 29, to be honest, because I think maybe the last round, um, Maki was actually really kicking a lot more. Right. I actually think it would have been interesting to see the extension, see how. Yeah, another round? You mean? Yeah, because yeah. if we saw the extension, then this would really put Kondo in a in a tight spot where he had to fight really, really hard for it. Yes. Because we, we see, I mean, I think the, the stronger one, if that's the proper word, Maki was the one, and he, he was still the same, like in the third round too, yeah, and bringing you know, all that. Yeah. Like that more tightness to the game. You know, bleeding, yes, but, you know, tired, yes, but, you know, not as maybe, uh, slow paced as he was, as uh, Kondo was. True, true, true. Yeah, that was a bit of a mistake there. Mm. <laughs> okay, <laughs> mistakes do happen. We are, it's, er, it's human to err. Er. But Phil, very interesting fight. At 19, if he's that calm and collected in the ring, yep. I'm yeah. sure he can only get much better. Yeah, that's that's the good potential there. The calmness. It's a great yeah. matchmaker, actually. Yeah. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. That was uh, uh, 
the welterweight here at the K1 World Grand Prix 2021 Japan Caves Fiesta 4. This is day one, and there goes Kondo, winner's win.